Hi guys, welcome back to our channel. This is Vlogmas Day number 10. For those of you that are new, my name is Valerie and this is Ambrosio and we make videos about life in New York City on a budget and living well. We would like to talk to you about ATM machines and banking safety in New York City. All year, but especially during the holiday season, we have to be extra careful when using ATM machines or even using bank tellers inside a bank. When using ATM machines, make sure to always look over your shoulder. Make sure nobody is watching you, you know, putting your PIN number. Make sure that you count your deposit or your withdrawal out of public view when you're finished with your ATM transaction. When using your bank's teller window, always assume that someone that's online behind you could be watching you. So be extra careful there as well when you're getting your deposit ready. When making a cash withdrawal, try to remember to count the money as the teller is counting it to you, if at all possible. Also, ask the teller to put your withdrawal within an envelope. And if your withdrawal is really too large to you know, count with the teller and you have to count it, ask her to escort you to a private area so that you can do that privately without someone watching you. So know that it is possible to receive counterfeit money. Even though it's coming from a bank, most of the money within a bank is from customer deposits and most of it is counted by a machine. So they don't actually look at it. And I used to work for a bank, so I can tell you this is true. We would get counterfeit literally one dollar five dollar ten dollar twenty every denomination bills what i do when i withdraw money from a bank is because i'm good at checking for counterfeit money and i can do that very quickly i check it very quickly if you don't know how to do this you can buy a special pen you might have seen cashiers in a store use it it's um it it changes color when it that you try it on a bill that's it for this part of our video on to our christmas tip of the day we want to talk to you a little bit about gift wrap first of all the cheapest place hands down in new york city to buy gift wrap would be a 99 cent store there are tons of 99 cent stores scattered all over manhattan and they're really cheap not everything in a 99 cent store is 99 cents, but most things are inexpensive. However, many things are poor quality. But when it comes to, a, to gift wrap, most of us are not concerned about the quality. The next thing to talk about when it comes to gift wrap is what happens if you're wrapping your gifts and you run out of gift wrap and you're doing it at night and the stores are closed or you've run out of it and you just don't want to buy anymore or you just need a small amount of it here are some ideas that you you can use first of all if you're wrapping a gift for a child just take the Sunday comic section out of your newspaper that makes really great gift wrap for a kid second of all if you need some extra gift wrap Try using holiday shopping bags like Macy's usually has a really colorful and really nice looking shopping bag. Try and use that. And another option you have is just go into your kitchen and use aluminum foil. This also gives a very sophisticated look to your gift wrapped item. It can also be used for Hanukkah or Christmas. Well, that's it for this video, you guys. Please give it a thumbs up. Please subscribe by hitting the red button below. We really do appreciate it if you could do that. And we will see you in our next Vlogmas video. Thanks again. Take care. Bye. Bye.